This is the flicker effect in After Effect. Once inside your composition, go into the Shape Layer tools, then go down to the Star tool, press and drag to create a star. By dragging out and in, you can scale it up or down. You can also move it around by holding in the spacebar to drag it wherever you like, holding Ctrl Command to drag out the points a little bit further or drag it in. But we will choose something like this. Then by using the arrow keys, you can also change how many points you want. So for now we have five, but if you press the arrow key up, you will add points to it by holding in the mouse at the same time by pressing up. Then you can also erase them by pressing the arrow down, down to three points. But we will choose something like this, eight points. And then to get it a bit more aligned in the middle, you can hold in shift, and then let go of the mouse. You want the anchor point in the middle, so hit Control alt home to get it centered. Then we want to align it in the middle, vertically and horizontally. We have our first shape layer. This we can name star middle. Duplicate this by hitting Control D. Enter, name it star left. Drag while holding shift to move it along a perfect line. Do the same way scaling one of the corners, holding shift at the same time, scale it proportionally. Somewhere like this, move it where you like. And then we want the third one, hitting Control D, enter, star right. Then we will move this to the right side. Next, go to the effects and presets, type in flicker. For the one to the left, we will use the flicker in, the middle one, use the flicker loop. And for the very right one, we will use the flicker out. Hit spacebar. And this is how the effect will look like. Hit Ctrl T, get out the text tool. I will be using the Proxima Nova text, medium, 35px, but you can use whatever you like. Right in, hit V, again Ctrl Alt Home to get the anchor point in the middle. Align it horizontally and by holding Shift and drag at the same time, put it somewhere in the middle. Duplicate this layer, double click it, name this out, hit V. And drag it over to the very right star tool. And the last duplicate, name this loop. And there we can use the align tool directly, horizontally and vertically. Double click it again, type loop. Once here, go into the effects presets one more time and the flicker in to the in text, the flicker loop to the loop text, the flicker out to the out text. Hit spacebar again, and this is how it looked like. While the final effect, let's go into the star middle, the looping one, and to represent the looping, let's go into the contents, the polystar one, polystar path one, and we will create a keyframe for the inner roundness. So to create a keyframe, click the time watch in the very beginning of the timeline, go to the middle, and here we will go lower it somewhere until the lines meet, about there. Go to the end of the timeline, mark the first keyframe, hit Ctrl C and then Ctrl V to paste it in the very end. Then mark all the keyframes by either dragging over them or sometimes it's easier to hit Ctrl Alt A, which also mark all the visible keyframes. And then we will ease them by hitting F9. Hit spacebar and this is your final animation.